This unique pen and stationery store is indeed one of a kind, owned and operated by German native Detlef Bittner, and originally founded at the Court of the Fountains in Carmel. Bittner, the pleasure of writing, relocated in 1999 to its present location on Ocean Avenue, between Mission and San Carlos, right next to Kerrigs. Bittner's rare shop sells both affordable and, you might say, unique collectible pens from all over the world. Before we examine these grand goods, let's meet the founder. Well, Detlef, it is great to see you again. This, for the first time, you being the host sponsor of our TV show, Monterey Bay and Beyond, instead of just a key sponsor. And what I love about this, Detlef, it's going to allow you at, to tell the public who you are, where you're from, what you're all about, in addition to your fine business. So let's start first off going way back. I know you're a native of Germany, obviously. I've got German roots. Uh, tell us about that small town between Stuttgart and Munich where you grew up. Born and raised in Germany, in a little town of Ulm, I was baptized in the Ulmer Münster, the tallest cathedral tower in the world. In the world? In the world, absolutely. And home of Albert Einstein, one of our store patrons. And uh, the home of Audi. Car week is coming up, so home of the great German brand, Audi. And Delaf, I also know you're an only child. And tell us a little bit about your early childhood in Germany. I was an apprentice for a steel dye engraving printing company. And I got to meet the great German typographer Hermann Zapf and the great calligrapher Joachim Roman and other really famous people in the calligraphy, writing and typography field. And that's how I got exposed to papers, fine printing, steel dye engraving. And that really fueled my love for paper and stationery and pens. Now Detlef, I, I think I recall you telling me you were about 14 when your dad gave you your first pen. He gave me my first Mont Blanc fountain pen when I was 14. I can remember every big occasion, birthdays or um, anniversaries, he would sit and write poems and write them out in beautiful calligraphy and read them at the, at the parties. That was always a special occasion. Okay, Detla, fast forward now to America. Why did you move to the U.S. from Germany? Well, when I was in school and I was 13, 14, I told all my friends, when I will be 18, I'm going to move to the United States. And indeed I did, but I was 22. And uh, I didn't come to the United States, but I came to California. First came to San Francisco, opened a design studio in San Francisco, and then spent um, a few years in Beverly Hills in the Los Angeles area, and then came with my wife Cynthia to come out. Uh, Detlef, how did you come up with your business, Bittner, the, the pleasure of writing? How did that evolve? And I started with a design office for corporate identities and um, created some wonderful corporate designs, with started, starting with the Commonwealth Club, their identity. So I did the Huntington Hotel in San Francisco and then also the uh, county seal of the county of Santa Clara. Now you've been in business for decades in Carmel, but as you've been in business, and we're now in 2015, the era of computers and new operating systems every other month. How have you maintained a business of selling pens? It's 25 years this year. Well, here we are. We're just ready to premiere our website version 8.0 and we reach the whole entire world and we connect, educate and teach our customers and beginners how to use fountain pens and pens properly and introduce them also to the fine art of collecting pens. Yeah. And Detlef, we're now joined by your beautiful wife, Cynthia. And I understand, Cynthia, you two guys, so successful with Bittner, the business here in Carmel, are now giving back to the community with a new initiative. Tell us about it. It's called the Children's Handwriting Initiative. And it's to bring writing back into schools for the younger, for elementary students. And it's putting an actual pen, a fountain pen, in their hands so they can learn the art of writing. Every purchase you make at Bittner or online, bittner.com, part of the proceeds will go to fund the Children's Handwriting Initiative and you can also donate and contribute on our website. Well, Detlef, thank you so much. I appreciate Cynthia coming in as well. But I know we're in a moment we're going to get the tour of the headquarters of Bittner, the pleasure of writing. I can't wait. <laughs> 